What's going on, everyone? ChristianPickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Syracuse versus Cornell college basketball matchup going down Tuesday, December 5th, 2023. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between Syracuse and Cornell. Syracuse coming into this one. 5-3 and three on the year after an 84-62 loss to Virginia in their last matchup. Meanwhile, Cornell coming into this game at 7-1 and one on the year, fresh off a fourth straight victory in a 79-71 victory over Lafayette in their last game. And, uh, you know, the thing with Cornell is that they haven't really had many step-up spots this season. The one that they did on the road was a 90-83 loss to George Mason. Outside of that, their other seven wins, the highest ranked opponent they played and got the, the victory over was 167th ranked Fordham that they beat on the road 78-73. Everyone besides that is either lower ranked or not ranked at all as they played Morrisville State prior to that game against Fordham. So take that for what it's worth. While uh, Syracuse, on the other hand, you know, they played a much tougher schedule. Three teams inside the Ken Palm top 30. All those were losses, though, for the Orange as well. And you know, I do lean towards Cornell and the points for a side because I'm still not there with Syracuse as of yet. The offense looks has looked good, but the defense at times has really looked shaky um, in spots. You know, as I just don't know if the Orange are really comfortable with Adrian Autry as of yet taking over from uh, from Jim Beheim. So we'll have to see how that sort of shakes out. So far, the numbers aren't terrible. Autry, you know, has the the Orange 118th in adjusted offensive efficiency and 105th on defense. Um, but again, just really struggling in the step-up spots. Now, I wouldn't necessarily classify Cornell as a step-up spot for Syracuse, especially when you look at, like I said, a lot of teams they played four matchups in their last five against teams in the Ken Palm Top 100 as well with the win over LSU at home. But uh, I still think that this is going to be a, hardly, a, a hotly contested game back and forth. Um, but not only do I like Cornell with the points, I love the over in this game. And I said, you look at what both of these teams have been able to do. And if you look at Syracuse's four home games, they put up 79 plus in all four of those games. So I think they're going to be able to turn this into a track meet with Cornell. But Cornell in the past has been proven that they can, you know, go, go right there with Syracuse as well. And uh, in a lot, in some of their road games this season, they, they put up 84 against Lehigh, 78 against Fordham, 83 against uh, George Mason, 79 against Lafayette. So I think that that Cornell could uh, could put up a fight here. This could be, you know, like I said, one of those back and forth kinds of games uh, where it could end up being decided late by the team that has the ball last. Could also be decided at the free throw line. Historically, Syracuse has dominated this matchup. Um, and a lot of unders have come through, but I think this is the one year we start to really kick that trend and turn it in the right in the other direction. So I'm going to go with the over 165 and a half between Syracuse and Cornell. And that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here. Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.